All right, hope that light's not too bright. All right, this is a story where I, I basically found a bomb um, back in, uh, I believe it was September of, of 2018. And uh, at that time, I had a, a legal issue going on with the Boston Police Department. Um, I'll put my little dot com thing in there if you are interested in reading about that, which is very interesting. But let's get to this story. So anyways, I was strongly advised by my attorney, uh, James Sultan. Uh, by the way, you're in the Boston area. Uh, if you need an attorney, you're in a jam. He's the guy. As another attorney told me, he is in the Lawyer Hall of Fame. But anyways, so I'm down the flea market in Lynn, which I, I'm a pretty good customer. I, I went down there every, every Saturday or Sunday. Um, it's no longer there. Um, so I'm going to this table and uh, I, I, I see this, this tannish canister. And I'm like, hmm. Seeing that I used to work with explosives in the Marines, I kind of know what explosive canisters look like. Hand grenades come in a smaller greenish type cylinder. This was a little bit bigger and a brownish canister. Uh, and the markings were the... Uh, our, 105 uh, um, gee, I can't even pronounce it um, howitzer uh, and that's a cannon and a lot of the uh, not a lot but you would take this and it, it, it's on the shell itself and, and a firing pin hits it and once it hits it it, it does an explosion that um, reacts to the rest of the shell makes it explodes and that's what makes your your round goes out of the cannon um, so anyways I, I, I go to the vendor I'm like hey um, do you know what you have here no 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 for you five dollars I'm like no 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 <laughs> um, this is I'm trying to explain to him what it is and he's not getting it finally I go it's a fucking bomb okay you hit this and it's gonna explode he turns around and goes, oh, you, you, you can have it for free. No, 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 I, I don't want to touch it. Um, you need to call somebody, like the fire department, uh, bomb squad. You know, no, 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 for free, for free. I'm like, dude, call somebody. So I'm walking away, and uh, I kind of look back, and the other vendor table, there's this girl that's there all the time, Saturday and Sunday. She has to be in, like, high school. But she's there every single Saturday and Sunday working, you know, I, I assume for her dad. And I was thinking to myself, this fucking thing goes off, you know, it's, it's not going to be good for anybody. And of course, the other side of me is like, you know, my attorney is like, avoid all law enforcement. And I'm like, finally, I went back to this guy, I go, listen, you need to call somebody. Oh, no, 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 yeah, 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 we're like, we're like, we're like, yeah. You sit for free, right? And he goes, yes, for free. I'll, you you take it, you take it. So I was pretty confident it was stable. I mean, if it go out there and it didn't explode, I'm sure if I can take it from the flea market and bring it in the back of Walmart in a vacant, like, blocked-off uh, parking lot, I, I'm sure I'd be all right. So that's what I did. I, uh, I picked it up and I brought it down to, you know, this... Uh, not a deserted area, but it's gated, so no one could really get there. And plus, I'm going to be there if anybody's going near it. I'm going to, you know, tell them what the danger is. So finally, I I, I get it down there, and um, I call Lynn Police Department, and um, you know, the response time wasn't really quick. Finally, uh, I think it was my third phone call. Uh, finally, I'm like, hey, listen, you know, I have an explosive de device down here. Um, New cup, new, oh, I'm sorry, new shirt, new cup. <laughs> and uh, so anyways, I told the dispatcher about the uh, explosive device. And uh, you know, it's funny, within minutes, the fire department shows up with Lynn PD. Uh, the bomb squad came from Logan Airport and they, uh, they took over. But here's the uh, videos that I shot that day. All right, uh, enjoy. So I'm at the uh, the Lynn Flea Market, and this container here is an M341 uh, 4A1. It's a lot number on it for uh, a center cartridge 
for a 105 millimeter. I believe it's a howitzer. So I asked the guy if he knew what he had and he had no idea. He didn't know what to do with it. So I brought it down here. I'm gonna call the proper authorities just in case um, it's live. I'm sure it is, but it needs a pin to actually uh, detonate, so. So I'll be calling them. Not that I need more problems, but here we go. So I called Lynn a few minutes ago, Lynn PD, and the dispatcher said he'd bring someone down. That was a few minutes ago, so I don't know what's taking them so long. Told him I was behind Walmart. Just, they hope he's not going to Walmart on Union Street. Wait, that's Walgreens. Yeah, that's the only Walmart in Lynn. So anyways, I put it over here so nobody's around. What the hell's taking them so long? So I'm waiting and waiting for the police to show up. So I called them back and I was like, hey, uh, are you sending anybody down here? And she goes, oh, it's a change of shifts. Um, it's going to take a little longer. I'm like, you know, this might be an explosive device. You might want to step it up. So now she says they're going to send the fire department. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. There's this guy looking at me. <laughs> and he drives away. <laughs> you know, I wasn't really thinking, but seeing that I'm in a little legal problems. So it says no trespass and please take notice. Notice no dumping, which I just did. And then National Grid even tells me no trespassing. No. Oh, is that me? What the hell's that? I'm still waiting. No idea where these people are. Hopefully, I'll never have a heart attack on a uh, change of shifts because I'd be dead. What the hell? All right, so be here. So I'm sure they'll take pictures and stuff like that. Hopefully I can give my information and leave.